Bye, everyone. Hey, welcome back to Half Life Opposing Four. Oh, there was a. Sm the gun turned black. Okay, welcome back. I was just talking about SMG4 and how um, it's kind of gone down the SML path. Yeah. Where they just changed the design of the characters and everything. And they apparently did um, the, the main character in Metal Runner, who's also in the SMG4 videos, is actor got fucked over as well. And they changed it for some reason. Yeah. I don't know why this. I don't know what the story is from that. Uh, I just heard shit like that. The fuck am I supposed to do? Uh, yeah. For some weeks, I actually watched Marijuana season one. I actually didn't enjoy it. But I didn't watch the rest. I watched some of the second, and then I didn't watch the third at all. Damn. It was alright. The thing I was impressed with is that SMG4 made it. Yeah. Which immediately made me go, oh, wow. Like, the fact that it wasn't shit. <laughs> it was actually really, like, decent, you know? Yeah. So, honestly, I think the best thing they've made is Digital Circus. Is that even done yet? No, two episodes. Yeah, that blew the fuck up. Yeah, and honestly, uh, surprisingly, I think it's actually deserved. Yeah, that's actually... Fact that it only has 400 million views, but that's more popular than SMG4 itself. Wow. Like, there, um, there's a second channel called Glitch where they put all the animations in. It has more subscribers now. Yeah, honestly... Well, that's their main thing now. Which is honestly a good idea. Yeah, that's... Like, that's actually where they all do the original stuff. On a, the thing oh, is... Oh, they made murder drones! Yeah. I'm, Fuck, I keep... I was hearing that at fucking everywhere. And I was like, what the hell is this shit? <laughs> they made it! Oh, oh, okay. Fucking hell. I'm not over SMG4 headquarters over there. Fair enough to you lot. Yeah, you guys made um, fucking two big things, actually. So, maybe yeah, they... didn't even blow up that much. No. Really yeah. Honestly, uh, I think they actually bypassed Disney, like, in terms of success. I don't know if that surprises you at all. I don't like that though. Hmm? Um, Sunset Paradise Saturday Night Funkin'. Uh. Rather not. What else even words could Saturday say? <laughs> Oh, I'm in a new chapter, it seems. I don't know what those black ops are up to. It doesn't it's involve crazy getting us out of here alive. How We've got no choice but to find their our way out. other channel blew up way more. Let's go! Yeah, I'm glad the one with more quality did, though. That's yeah, honestly like a rarity. Because SP4 is just like, you know, like a I think people are starting to get tired of that shit, and honestly, that gives me faith in humanity. Ooh. 
Maybe I sound like an old fart, even though I'm just supporting how people feel now anyways, which doesn't even make sense. But, yeah, who knew when those kind of people eventually grew up, they would prefer real stories. I actually do like the SMG4 arcs. The, the Waluigi one's cool. Um, the rapper Bob Art one was cool. I haven't yeah. watched all of the anime arc though. I was in a server where someone was kept talking about it, and I'm like, I don't know any of this. <laughs> the YouTube arc and Genesis arc was cool. Revelations arc, I haven't watched that. I, I think I have this problem. Where it's just a specific me thing where I, I can't associate what SMG4 does with anything serious. Like, those arcs, like, they sound like... I don't know what it is, they just don't really interest me. But I probably just need to try and watch them properly. All I'll say is, you know you don't like the, the backrooms thing they did? If you did watch Shares, I thought you'd probably be okay with it. Because that would be Like, when, when we originally watched the back of the video, we could tell there was some other shit going on. But after watching the Genesis arc, I was like, oh, that's actually pretty cool. The thing is, is that I can tell it's very tropey. Like, it's it's literally just ripping off the tropes and cliches of other things and doing its own version of it. And those Pacific quote, no, Pacific tropes and cliches it's riffing on, I just don't have any interest in. Like, it's a very, like, anime-type inspired story. Yeah. And, like, that doesn't interest me in any sort of way, so... I found most of them fun, they are. And, like, the only hook I would really have is that, oh, it's, it's Mario's stuff, because... When I think of like the internet meme side of it, I'm like, God, this is so stupid. Like, I cannot. Yeah. The thing is, that stuff was just not. I just don't have any like relatability. No, Waluigi would like it, the enemy side. Yeah. But yeah, I, I don't know. The thing is, though, there's a lot. Of, of similar things, bless you, that I've been able to to really like. So I I don't know. It's I guess it's just a case where I need to actually give it a try. It's just I don't feel that inclined to because like it just doesn't interest me much. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I can't remember why I watched it. But it was a, it was a similar thing. It, it it gave me a similar vibe of like when I saw a Path of Cycle. Because it was like like a, a funny like Mario channel I've been uh, watching for fucking ages. And I realised they like I was like, oh shit. So I can't mind him. Well to be honest, I prefer to pass on the Yeah. So I just uh prefer it. I probably prefer it for life as well to be honest. Uh, but whatever. That's another thing I'd probably struggle to get into, Chungus. Oh, yeah, I, I doubt you would. You, I, I guarantee, though, you'd prefer Fog Life, because it's, like, very GTA. Honestly, I don't know. It kind of depends on how they do it. Yeah, but, like, more than Path of Psycho, because it's, like, score drama. Yeah. Which, just like, at the time, I was very into stuff like that, so... I just come from a completely different time, so there's a there's a barrier of relatability, yeah. which is ironic because you technically come from a time even earlier than me, but whatever. Yeah, so when I first watched Path Cycle, I had no idea what it was. So like, as it went along, I was like, oh, this is cool. Like, I know what Path Cycle is, but after my first watch, I didn't understand it at all. And when I rewatched it, I actually uh, understood what I was, what I meant. The part that interests me is the psychological part, but yeah, same. That's the thing that interests me the most as well. Just it... thinking of of uh, some kid who's just trying to go through school, but he has something wrong with him. Wait, he has like so many minds at once and so many things torn to him. 
It honestly reminds me of the, the Ultimate Spider-Man comics a lot because that comic series at the beginning took a more dark approach to the usual Spider-Man stuff where like he's... Like, the supervillains were actually treated as, like, actual threats he's fucking terrified of. He doesn't know what he's doing at all. And to make things worse, the, according to Nick Fury, the moment he turns 18, like, he loses all rights because he has superpowers. So he's just going to be forced to join S.H.I.E.L.D. Yeah, and, like, Walter just passed, passed like, when he was, his mind's so fucked. It's, at home, everything was going shit. He had an abusive... He had abusive dad. He thought he had a brother that was on his head for so many years. And at school, his life was just some shit as well. So it was just all toxic. So everything was just terrible. And every day was just worse and worse. And he slowly got more insane. And slowly, his brother faded away. Because the brother was the representation of the angel part of him. But eventually, he fucked off. And then the devil side of him came out. And it was only that. And that's when he was all, like, suicidal and shit, and just, yeah. Oh, but boy. the beginning, he was normal, and he was happy in life, but, yep. You're gonna get raped in the ass and stuff. Oh, God. Sounds alright. But, uh, yeah. This is Folk life is definitely different now. Wait a moment, this boss is bitch. Alright, ammo please. I meant to say health, but whatever. <laughs> Can't think of anything else that gave me that feeling. <laughs> oh god. Just on that. Oh, I wasn't fucking ready. What? What's that? What? What? Did you make something? Maybe. Oh god, alright, what is it? It says announcement, Wallace. And what's funny is on the phone, that emoji looks completely different. It's supposed to be yellow. Alright, what is it? The hell? Eggman, come take a look at this. Look, it's red like you. Mm. Alright, looks like you're in our live reaction, Chungus. Alright. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Smash cracking tournaments back. Yeah, me. <laughs> oh my god. Mm. <laughs> Bot. Mm. That's me. Oh god. <laughs> 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 what is this? Krusty mm. Batman! <laughs> what? Me <laughs> <laughs> face! <laughs> mm. Consider all. Shrek! Larry! Mm. <laughs> Biggie! <laughs> Biggie Oyster! Mm. Wario, Waluigi. <laughs> Dad! <laughs> what? Why is he here? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, God. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> man. This is fucking good. Oh, Sinos! Grob! 
<laughs> Look at that cunt. <laughs> what? Oh, fuck. Chug this. I made that also on a shitter. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck, Chungus? Wait, wait. So Cranking Smash Tournament 7? Yep. It's coming the 19th of October, guys. Huh. Well, I that's guess... That's on a Saturday, by the way. Well, guys, I guess that's going to happen. So on that Saturday, we're going to spend the day doing that. It didn't say every contestant, but there are new people, such as Bart, Tad. There will also be others as well. Hmm. Yeah, what do you think? Magical. Also, I think there was something you missed at the beginning. Oh, wait, let's dissect. So the return. And then if this is the official logo. Cracking Smash... I have to search up Roman numerals for this shit. <laughs> Cracking Smash 27. Oh, nice logo. Alright, so I kind of did... You know, like, the trailer for Smash Ultimate? Like, yeah, when, I could, yeah, I could tell it was doing that. Yeah, it's so number one trailer. But you probably should... Uh... Number 26, Shaggy. Oh. Shaggy's going to be in the tournament. Oh, fuck's sake. Really? Yeah, Shaggy. He, he's number 26. I'm just annoyed I'm not in the fucking thing. Who? Woody. Well, I didn't show everyone in this. Ah. Grommet. <laughs> the Fario. Mm -hmm. That's number five. Doctor, F Doctor Four. Number four was um, Eggman. He was laughing like a twat. And then <laughs> number 15 is Homer. And then Bart's first appearance. That's number 16. And then you have Knuckles, Sonic, and Tails. That will obviously be in it. And then you have Mario, Luigi. Fate one crusty, six Batman as well, you know they be there. And then this is a new one as well. May Pig Face has never been there, Cracking Smash Tournament. And he will be. May Pig Face, what do you have to say about this? Wait, is he even here? I don't think he is. No, I don't think May Pig Face is here. That's unfortunate, isn't it? But yeah, May Pig Face is first appearance on here. And Cinnamon's back as well. Shrek! Larry, Iggy, Piggy Oinkster, <laughs> look at him, <laughs> you gotta love Piggy Oinkster, he's back. Junior, Bowser, Wario, Waluigi, Tad, Tad, the fact that I took Tad to the seventh one, I know right, I'm finally here, but the question is, how am I here? Mm. How, how are you, I'll, I'll figure it out, Tad, don't worry. Yeah, Tad's finally actually going to be a part of it. Uh, number 27, Rouge, I think, his first appearance was in the last one as well. These, Patrick, um, Patrick, yep, these two are in the last one. Just showing Eggman's piss machine. And me versus Shaggy. Shaggy being there will be weird here. Mm. <laughs> and Sinar, she's showing up. So yeah, I didn't show everyone. Piggy <laughs> Winkster. <laughs> and then yeah, October 19th. The fuck? <laughs> I think that might deserve to go in the Retards trailer playlist. Probably, yeah. Yeah, the Kraken Smash Tournament has never had a trailer before. Mm. So, like, this is actually, like, proper. Most things haven't had a trailer. So, yeah, yeah. it's pretty unexpected. Yeah, the last Kraken Smash Tournament was, uh, like, three, four months ago. This is one that will be uh, actually filmed. This is the seventh one, the next big one. Mm. Um, so, yeah, uh, that was the special video. Well, I went on the channel, obviously. I ate that in like an hour. <laughs> Shitter. <laughs> oh my god. I don't really mean the Fario's in it. Yeah, I think we all are. Holy shit, I was. In, I don't know what I was doing.
Oh boy. See, that was the big announcement. Crack and Smash tournament's back with a bang. Well, guys, uh, that's something to look forward to. Yeah, yeah I'll be there on 19th. There are other people that are in it. The four um, Ross are going to be announced soon. Hmm. Yeah, so something like organised. <laughs> organised? Yes. Oh yeah, one thing, when Crack and Smash Tournament 10 comes, oh boy, mm. that's gonna have to be the biggest one yet, which I don't know how we're gonna get bigger than the fifth one. <laughs> Yeah. That was very unexpected though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I do. Well, I guess I, I know what I'm doing that day. Yep. So yeah, the la last one. Um, we have three weeks today. Three months ago, the fifth of June was the last one. When, what day did it end? Was it all on one day? Probably, it usually is. Yeah. Yeah, the fifth one was a big fuck off one. Oh boy. Yeah, eight months. It happens like every few months, I suppose. Then. At the start, it happened constantly. Yeah. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Yeah, the first one was eight months ago. Mm. All the Crack and Smash tournaments have been this year. Wow. Yeah. But if you want to get technical, it started in Series 6. God, the first one was so good, though. I forgot this was a thing. God, they got so many views. <laughs> Worthless pile of cum. Fucking hell, bunted and taking a shit. I'm sorry, I love this fuck, Bill. <laughs> <laughs> 
That's the best one I could find. Look at the Wallace. <laughs> Look at the phone one as well. I love that Wallace. I should have used that one. But it wasn't the first video, so... Yeah. But fucking love um, Wallace. Wallace in front of Pirate, but he's so happy. He's like, yes, fire night. I could have always ignored that it wasn't the first video and just didn't use that one anyways. Yeah. Spider-Man 2. Spider-Man. So fucked. Oh, there's nothing fucking here. Fuck you! <laughs> So. Well, we don't do season three. Why am I in Zen? Because it's so repetitive. Three Sonic Prime episodes are the exact same. Yeah, they're fucking fun. That's why I didn't watch the film. Oh, for fuck's sake. I felt like they were milking it. I remember when there was that picture of Shadow next to Donald Trump. <laughs> Yeah, that turned out to be a fucking lie. I mean, no shit. <laughs> How the fuck were they gonna do that? Oh, I, d I can't fucking do this. I don't have enough fucking health. I might be fucked. <sighs> fuck you! Jesus, when I'm Go in the thing, you twat. Good, you're fucking dead. Alright, most annoying part of the game is over with. It's a lot. Oh, Sonic Origins is a lot. Yeah, that isn't even all of them anymore. Um, Tails plays hide and seek. Wait, I can't remember him even doing it. Uh, what did that do? Something apparently. I don't trust this game right now. Jungle's is just being nostalgic right now. Yep. Lex uh, and the Rats for season four. Unlimited. Of course, uh, Catholic. Oh yeah, unlimited series of what? Series 1 is so fucking short. <laughs> Julia Jones is fucking legendary. Mm -hmm. oh, fuck, alright, finally. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to see this. Look, oh, fucking hell. Oh, 
I remember this was. Um, this is why I can't take Junior seriously because mm. of shit like this. <laughs> this is the guy who's always trying to fight me. I fucking can't. <laughs> to be honest, if Junior was just a little demo, he would do this. Two was so weird. Big fight got extended. God, fucking grown four. The phone now reminds me of my last game. Oh yeah, I is see. This a rainbow it. background. I know we love fucking using that all I the know, time. Vanos Gaming. If, they also did like a parody team ten thing. Although what? Poor Bravo's Gromit mimicking again. Oh, uh, that's Jake, right? I don't fucking know. I mix them up all the time. I, I didn't bother to memorize who was who. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> this video is so fucked. <laughs> but I don't want, like Wallet. I was trying to make him talk. <laughs> like, they still experiments on the dog. <laughs> I don't, I'm chunkers, just, just throws Pepsi in them and it opens it and it goes out. I don't want to do this. <laughs> don't open it, chunkers, but he was last words. <laughs> so stupid. God. Oh shit. I can't remember which one it was. What are you looking for? Like, any hints of if he was Logan or Jake? Uh. Oh, he's in a suicide forest. So I, I know which one is. Oh, and he found a dead body. It's Woody. And he filmed it. All right. Wait a minute. Is this after the Helen Abel one? Oh, shit. Maverick Gromit merch. I'm dying. Uh, um, I'm kind of glad that I don't get the reference. Oh, I, I know what. Um, well, it said to the dead body, do you want my merch? And that's because, I don't know if this is actually true, but apparently when Logan saw the dead body, he put a piece of his clothing merch on the dead corpse. That's how he promoted his merch. So, oh, God. I think that's what it was referencing here. Yeah. We need a socialist revolution. Oh. <laughs> I found a dead body. Hello? Well, in this universe, Gromit didn't actually find the dead body and do it, he faked it. 
he didn't actually go to a suicide forest just went and started. So he just faked him being a twat. But Logan actually was a twat, so it's different. Which is worse? Logan, for sure. Because even though faking it is a twat move, actually doing it is way worse, at least to me. <laughs> oh my god. What the fuck am I supposed to do? I don't remember. Among us. Hello, neighbor. Manifesto. This built and everything, I feel. This is when it actually became like what it is. What the fuck? The Hello Neighbor one happened before the one with the Woody body. Which is weird to me, because at the end of the Hello Neighbor one, Woody's body like explodes after he gets thrown into into the wall. Weird. Unlimited Series 2 is so weird, though. Every season is so different from the last. Unlimited feels like a show where... It just changes, like, its whole theme and its style every season. Which... She Hulk, watch party. Oh, uh, yeah. What are these thumbnails with this? You little bastard. Well, I'm just trying to make She Hulk just have some actual value. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna end Yeah, this no, one. this is my favourite thumbnail. They're on this fucking Muppet. Yeah. Well, yeah. Alright guys, that's the end of this part, because it's 37 minutes, and the next one is probably going to be the final one, because I know I'm on the last chapter of Venture the game. Venture fail, that's so funny. <laughs> so See yeah. you next one, and good ties.